Hey everybody, I'm Amy. I'm Dan. We're the Hustle Couple coming at you today with Thursdays. Ship with us on Poshmark and eBay. <laughs> eBay and Poshmark. That's right. You guys. Oh my God. You your guys. lucky symbols helped us so much. They really did. Thank we you for doing that. A really good Man. overnight sales. Some bangers in here. There are a couple. You know, I don't know. eBay been like not working out for us, but we got some couple bangers. Couple in, there's a couple in there. We are shipping 10 things on eBay and three on Poshmark. All right. And shall we start? Let's just get right down to it. We are. Dan's got to go pick up my prescription, so we kind of got to go. Kind of got to go. This is a brand new with tags, a Victoria's Secret scarf. This is actually Victoria's Secret this time. Hey. Ayo. Uh, it is new with tags. I got it at the fins, I think. Nope, this was $5.99. I don't know where this came from. I have zero clue where this came from. <laughs> Five ninety nine. Five ninety nine. You must be out of your mind. Out of your mind. I didn't pay five ninety nine for this. It's over fourteen dollars. I swear. I think this is bins. So this was from twenty twenty one. That's what it says on here. So who knows? Who knows? We don't know what we were doing. Who knows? Do you know what it's gone? Get it out of here. It's a good, nice, fluffy scarf. Love that. Yeah, you can tell it's from a little while ago from the inventory number, and it's in this like self sealing. Mm -hmm. T-shirt bag. Thirty-five oh one. Thirty-five oh one. Let's let me tell you a little bit about it. Please do. Victoria's Secret bl plush plaid check holiday scarf pink blush gray super soft eighty eight inches. Wow, that was hard. And it was listed October twenty fourth, twenty twenty one. And now it's old <laughs> on Poshmark for fourteen dollars. It was only listed for 19 So, like, there's no way we paid $5.99 for that. No way. I'm going to put it in as that, but one of us had a brain fart. Yeah, something something must have happened there. 40 Hey! Is he still going? Bit. Yeah, it's still going. We're still going. It's just $5.70. Oh, the tape got all stuck. Oh, man. These next things are called shoes. <laughs> Sorry. Of the Nike persuasion. <laughs> Remember I told you the other day when we sold those raw these that we got a big bag of shoes from this lady for free? Yeah. From these, the Facebook? These were in that bag. They were in the back. And they were Nikes. Mm -hmm. We do not sell any kind of athletic shoe ever except yeah. when they're free. We're not sneaker people, really. We're just real bad at it. Not, not good at that game. Nike, women, size 8.5, down shifter, running shoes, sneakers, black, white. There are style numbers in Nike, which make them easy to identify. True. And yes. these were in good condition, so we listed them on August 8th. There you go. A little dusty. List. Is that dusty? August 8th, 2022. And then I relisted <laughs> them. I did not know. Maybe we should, they're kind of like... Crushed. Dusty. You should put like a little something in there, some tissue or something. Anyway, I relisted them 25 days ago. They sold on Poshmark for $26. All right, all right. There's some paper. I got some, I got some, I got some tissue. Oh, you got some tissue. Okay. You need a little some something. Toe, some toe tissue. Toe tissue. <laughs> <laughs> toe tissue. All right, 26 bucks. That's, I'll take it. Yeah. Oh, I gotta get a box for the next one. The next one's really good. Okay. It's real good. Yes, finally. Something good. All right, let's get one of these tiny thank you stickers. Mm -hmm. Free necklace. No, I'm just kidding. This is a Kendra scat. You got it for me. Whoopsie. Hey, okay. 
Okay, so when I'm at the, uh-uh, I'm going to let roll, I'm going to roll the box, excuse me. <laughs> when I'm at the thrift, sometimes they have uh, junk bags full of jewelry boxes, empty jewelry boxes, and I buy them because sometimes we sell jewelry. It's very rare, but sometimes we do. Sometimes we do. So we got to be prepared. Um, mm. We are doing a giveaway. Java mm. Sock giveaway. Y'all, we, 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 became, we became partners with Java Sock. Stand by, okay? <laughs> I was like, can you give us a call? Because we want to make custom Java Socks. And then they had a form on their website and I filled it out. Filled it out. Alright. Okay. So maybe we can give away customized ones in the future. Oh yeah. Oh that's yeah. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, that's fancy right there. I'm being fancy. Yeah, yeah you no, are. No, 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 no. Okay. The re you're gonna see why in just one memento. Yes. Right. Here's the shoes. So we've there. had this listed a long time, but I just relisted it with measurements because we didn't have measurements, and then I figured out, wait, this isn't selling because we don't have measurements. And Seriously, we don't have measurements. Who listed it? Yeah. Who who well, well, who went ahead and listed this? There we go. Yes. Okay. This is a Gucci watch. Yeah. And we paid up nineteen ninety two for it. Let's shine it up a little bit more. Right shine it up. Almost shiny. It's got a little, it's got a little red residue. Where's that shiny cloth? Um. Oh, I got those jewelry. Oh uh, yeah, you do. Jewelry wipes or whatever. Uh, it's a Gucci watch. I'm about to show you. Um, but the thing is, it's like one of the ones with links. And we didn't have the measurement of how big the wrist was. Because we, we silly. <laughs> we is we babies. This was listed on, oh my gosh, July 8th of 2021. Whoa. And I'm like, why isn't... I, we had a Gucci watch. We have another, like, we have a bunch of high-end watches that weren't selling. And they were all from the same lady because they're all the same wrist and we got them all the same day at the same store. And anyway, all right, we need to shine this, we need to shine the baby up. Can you show them? I'm gonna get the shiny cloths. Yeah, I'll just, I'll see if I can get it to, this is very tiny. Yeah, it's tiny. Yep. Oh, you can see the links, it's got the cool zigzags, but I don't know if it'll actually focus close enough on the, on the, hey, there you can see the face. It does say Gucci under the 12. It's very hard to see, but on the back, there's a, on the case. Will it focus on the case and not my hand? Amateur hour, Hustle HQ, welcome. Kinda, you can kinda see there's the logo there. Okay. I tried, I tried really Here hard. Here we go, get in there, get in there with this. I'm gonna show them these. I love using these. They're connoisseurs, gold, silver, jewelry wipes. They're dry and they work really, really well. So keep these around. We, like I said, we don't sell jewelry a lot. I gotta get to the, the punchline here. This is over $120. Yay, uh, love buck that. 20 on posh. Gucci on posh. And so I'm gonna read to you what I put in the description because I think it's really helpful. Yeah, there's, it was, some, there's some tarnish coming off. Yes. I mean, when it's Gucci, you got to shine it up. <laughs> I, this is authentic Gucci. I was able to find what it was and write it all in here because I found another one that had sold. Gucci Lady Stainless Steel Zigzag Wrist Watch, Swiss made, and then it has the serial number or whatever the heck it is. And then I put in the title 6.75 inches. So then in the um, description, I said Gucci's Lady... <laughs> Hmm. Gucci Ladies Stainless Steel Zigzag Wristwatch Swiss Made fits a 6.75 inch wrist. Links can be taken out, but no additional links are included. So okay. you can make it smaller if you need to. That's what I'm saying. So this was listed in, like I said, in July of 2021. I relisted it, yes, I relisted it one month ago. And then it sold. Make it nice. Make it nice. Make it nice. There's no real way to do this ahead of time because jewelry just kind of gets tarnishy sitting. 
so we always have to do it whenever we sell jewelry the day of. But anyway, these, these gold and silver wipes, these are cheap on Amazon. Sometimes I find them at the thrift store and I'll pick them up there. We do have a, a washer thing for other jewelry. QC. Mm -hmm. oh. Oh. Sorry about that little... Is there any, um, is that adhesive from the tape? Next time we probably shouldn't table oh, watch. Oh my God, I got something in my nose. <laughs> no, I mean, I, I think it might just be a, a little scuff from something. Can I polish it out? Come on. Buff it out. Yeah, I see. That's a that's a stuff. Okay. Well, it was adhesive because you. C I mean, you could buff it out, but you'd have to like, like with compound and a little a little Dremel. We we ain't got time for that. I don't even have a comp. I don't even know what a compound is. <laughs> I do not have that. The polish polishing compound. Oh. All right, I'm gonna clip this thing in here so it doesn't slide around a whole bunch. Okay. Dan's gonna clip it. We're gonna send it. Do you need some bubble prep? Or is it good in that box? There you go. Look at that presentation. Fancy. Sorry. Yeah, it's still not. <laughs> oh, I should have lint rolled the inside. Dang it. All right, whatever. Okay. Now, we are moving on to eBay, and we're starting off with another super banger. So we just sold a piece of Gucci jewelry for $120. The next is a pair of pants. Love selling pants. That sold for more than twice that. What? what? <laughs> for a pair of pants, what? not a Gucci watch versus a pant. Can I get another air pocket, please? Okay. So, you're waiting with bated breath, I see. Hey. Hey. Thank you. Man, some of my notes. Five, seven, two, six. These pants are right These here. Pants. We paid thirteen oh five for them. Do you see that they're a very chunky tweed pant? The title is Ralph Lauren Purple Label, size twelve, cashmere, alpaca, wool blend, tweed Dang. dress pants. That's a nice blend of luxe fabrics right there. Luxe. So don't be afraid to price your items high if they are worth it. amazing fabrics like that. Right? So what I'm about to tell you is we spent $13.05 on these. These are Ralph Lauren Purple Label. We'll show you the label. Yep. They sold for $295. Woo! Plus shipping. So this is the example of long tail items we listed these a while ago I'll, I'll tell you exactly when yeah. and um they just sold we just waited and they sold for full price because that's what happens with these things we do not promote this is the kicker we don't promote or on sale anything that's over 200 dollars. Yeah. nothing we don't do it because i'm like the person that's gonna look for these look is looking those. for them they're awesome nice. all right i'll get the label here the purple label ralph lauren collection there you go. These are also made in the USA, which I included in the description. Yeah. This is the top tier of Ralph Lauren. Like, it, yeah, it the 100%, the best of the best is the purple label. Don't let anybody tell you any differently. It's the purple label for sure. There's some weird, wacky stuff going out in YouTube that I've heard in YouTube land. <laughs> and it's just 100% not true. The black label is good. Yeah. Don't get me wrong. It's good. And I will pick it up almost every single time. But it's just not as good as the purple label. Just not. This uh, was listed August 4th of 2022, and I last relisted it 25 days ago. You got a you got a bite from the latest relist. I got a bite, yes. and it was listed for 295 dollars, and that's what was paid. Bam! I did have it listed originally at 399, so I think when I relisted it. I drop the price. Yeah. hundred dollars. I don't know. Sometimes when it's like high end stuff like that, you kind of just got to feel it out. I don't know. Come on. Oh, he's just shoving it into a small no, bag. It's already in the bag. Here we go. Here we go, y'all. What is it? <laughs> <laughs> Don't hit a pad of flowers. All 
All right. Seven, one, six, two. Next is our girl, Eileen Fisher. Okay. Boom. This is, we just listed these last night. It love is a quick sale. Love that. Eileen Fisher, size large, black pull on, rayon lycra stretch pants, legging slim. I wonder if it's the same lady. Oh, I wonder if it is. You didn't even didn't even have to contact her. She's just like, boom, backup pair. So this one lady <laughs> had emailed us and was or uh messaged us and said, Oh my god, I'm so glad the last time we sold the pants, like last week, I've been looking for these pants. And then we found out that we had another one. So we we're gonna message her, but I just copied the title of my sold listing because I'm like, well, that title got to her. Yeah. I think it's the same lady. <laughs> yes. 10 ounces. All right, next is a pair of jeans. These are Dan's old pants. Dan pants. Dan pants. <laughs> uh, Kenneth Cole, <laughs> men's 32 by 32, dark blue five pocket, blasted wash, straight denim jeans. Blasted wash. These yes. sold for um, $14.99. <laughs> and that's great because they were free. Three ninety nine. <laughs> We've had them a long time. Thirty two sixty nine. We love selling our own clothes. Uh, these. Let's see here. They were listed nine six twenty twenty one. Wow, we're selling some older stuff. Yeah. It's good. That's really good. Okay. Today, if you didn't know, had a flat rate. Had a Is Am Fontaine Day? Let's learn I about Anne Fontaine. Know. It is just because we sold a bunch of Anne Fontaine. <laughs> this is my favorite brand to sell. I don't know why. I just have an affinity. I love Anne Fontaine. So we're going to learn together. Sweet. Where is Anne Fontaine? I think she's over here somewhere. 50, 5400. Oh, 5400. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Can you show them the label? Yes. Anne Fontaine is a French designer. Get to know her name because her pieces are very understated and you would never think twice they're just like button-down shirts and camisoles yeah, but there's always something a little special about them because she is a great designer this is seriously a jersey knit shirt like a t-shirt but the... it has a collar on it like a dress shirt come on no, it's all it's... go back go back go back because <laughs> it's, it's white it's there reflecting it there we go there we go there it is this is my girl. Okay. I love selling Anne Fontaine. It's a t-shirt. It's three, it's long sleeved. It has ruffles on the sleeve. I told you there's always something a little Just cool about silk it. Silk trim? Uh, mm, no, it feels... Mm, no. No, it doesn't feel like that. Okay. Uh, but it has this v-neck and it has this ruffle thing at the top here, kind of like a dress shirt. Mm -hmm. This is like a party in the front, business in the back kind of thing. I mean, <laughs> wait, strike that. <laughs> strike that, reverse it. Really, really nice piece. Uh, but if you were flipping through thrift racks, you might miss it. True. Okay, here's the title. Anne Fontaine, size 14, Liberty Black, ruffled blouse, size 40, uh, top 46, knit top, v geez, Louise, Amy, <laughs> v-neck blouse. It's not like I'm drunk. Take a breath. You'll be all right. All right. This sold for $68. Very nice. Yeah, I love Anne Fontaine. It takes a while sometimes to get the right buyer. Okay. Oh my gosh, what is happening here? We have an issue. What kind of issue? I hope I, I think I fixed this. I think when I relisted this, I fixed it. I need to go to eBay. I'm gonna tell you what the issue is in just one second. Okay. Let me make, yes, I fixed it. Yes. <gasps> okay. <laughs> when we imported to Venue, I had the wrong pictures in the listing. Oh, Lord. So How it was a happen? Simply top, not the Anne Fontaine top. But as you can see in this eBay listing... That is the correct, yes. I got it right. Yes. <laughs> That's why I also love relisting because you can catch things. Literally, I had the wrong dang pictures in the listing. <laughs> Whoa. Okay. Um... So nine ounces on that guy. Okay? That has been listed since May 26th of 2022, and I changed it to the right picture seven days ago, and then it's. <laughs> I wonder why. Hmm. What is wrong with me? Hmm. What did you say? Nine ounces? Yes, nine oh ounces. Oh my gosh. Okay, seven zero nine seven. This, guy, this is the Johnny Was that we just listed. It's been in my laundry room for 45 years, <laughs> and it has a stain on it. 
and I couldn't get the stain out. I mean, I probably could have. I tried once, and then I, it didn't come out. That's nice. It is nice. Um, but there's a big stain on it. But it's not so noticeable. I can't even see. Let me look in the monitor. And there's a stain on it. Is there? Yes. <laughs> Remember when we were listening, we were like, eh, is there? Uh, we did the same thing. Yeah, it's like, right. I don't know. Okay. Anyway. The, the main thing to learn here is that we were paralyzed. We didn't know what to do with it. So it sat in the laundry room. I tried to stain treat it. I couldn't do it. I sat there again because I was going to try it again. Finally, we were like, let's just list it with a stain on it. And then it's sold. So Johnny was size large, gray, Josephine, trapeze, short sleeve, tee, floral, embroidery. Sold for $30, which was our asking price. So, and I think it was only listed less than a week. So right? Somebody wanted it bad enough. They're like, I don't care about a little stain. Yeah. Give me that shirt. Or maybe they're really good at getting those stains. That could also very well be. This was listed for 10 days. <laughs> After sitting for 17 years. Yes. Um, lesson learned. We're getting, we're, I swear, <laughs> we're getting better. Uh, the next piece will shock you because... It's a brand that people say won't sell and a size that won't sell. Uh -oh. And it sold pretty quickly, actually. Uh, nine ounces. Uh, this is Zara. Oh, okay. You read about that. So this is Zara size extra small. <laughs> this is heavy. This is a knit double breasted blazer and it's hot pink. So for me, the classic cut of Zara in a bold color does really well. There's a lot of bold colors on the runway this year and last year. Remember in the inauguration, like everyone was wearing those like bright colored coats that match their dresses. Everybody's into like a color moment right now. And so we listed this Zara jacket. I, I paid for it. What did I pay for it? I think I got a bins. Zero dollars. I paid zero dollars for it. So this was given to us and I never listed it. So we got a bunch of Zara clothes from this girl that lived down the street from us during COVID times. Oh, yeah. And this was it. Yeah, I remember that. But then when we were going through our death pile, I was like, oh, this is the time to list this. So we listed it, and it sold for $34.95, so not huge money, but still good money, especially when we didn't spend any money on it. Six, five, two, one. I, I just didn't want to take it out of the bag because it's going to, Dan will spend seven hours trying to get back in there. Thank you. I appreciate that. Uh, whoever got it in there did a great job. <laughs> women, Zara women, size extra small, long line, pink blazer, jacket, peak lapel, double breasted. April did this. Okay. Good job, April. Yes. And it was listed for 27 days and okay. sold for $34.95. Pretty good. I had it listed for $49.95. And took, or I sent out an offer. I don't know. All right. Next is going to a viewer. All right. Not just any viewer. This is going to Taylor. And Taylor, I don't know if you know this about me. I'm from Fredericksburg. <laughs> I'm from your zip code. Hi. Hi. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe we knew each other. Like, I am from there for my whole life before I moved to Texas. I'm from Fredericksburg, Virginia, not Texas. I went to Stafford High School. The old Stafford High School. I don't know how old you are, <laughs> but I appreciate your purchase and I appreciate that you're living in Fredericksburg. It brings me much nostalgia. This is a torrid shirt that yes. I loved. Oh my gosh, if this was my size, it must be a Fredericksburg thing. Hey! <laughs> I was in Fredericksburg when this was first popular. Do you guys remember these little tiny, you know, embroidered daisies on everything? So cute. This is a button down shirt. And it's gray and it has these little daisies all over it. I loved it. I got it at the bins. She saw it in one of our halls. Is her name Taylor? Mm -hmm. I think the shirt is called a Taylor shirt. But her <laughs> name's Taylor. <laughs> all of this is so weird. Size 2, 2X Taylor cotton embroidered daisy. Taylor with the Taylor shirt. Yeah. In Fredericksburg. In Fredericksburg. Okay. That's awesome. Thank you for your support. Appreciate it for sure. Padded flat red envelope. Um... I don't know exactly where your house is. I don't know that. But I will tell you that I lived on the same street as Falmouth Elementary my whole life. My parents no longer live there, so I can say that. 13 ounces. Thank you, Taylor. Thank you. All right. Two more Infontaines. What? No way. 
Yep. Nice. So these are camisoles from Anne Fontaine. They're just tank tops. They're boxy and they have a square neckline. How are three Anne Fontaine so, items going to sell to two different people on the same day? This is a bundle. What's happening? I smell like, <laughs> I smell this, like cologne or something. A little bit. Mm -hmm. Just face that. I hope we do. It's okay. Anyway, these are Anne Fontaine. I will show you. The bag smells more than the shirt. Okay. That's weird. Oh, that's weird. Okay, so these are super <laughs> stretchy. This is the cut of it, and this is the, what a square neckline looks like. Here's the Logue and Fontaine. Nice. There's a pink one and an ivory color one. They're, they feel like a micro modal or something. The Here you go. The nice. um, April took pictures of these, and I listed them. Anne Fontaine, size 12, 44, square neck, lady tank top. Lady tank top. Lady tank that's what it's called. The model is called Lady. It says it on the tag. I didn't, I wasn't saying it was a lady. <laughs> uh -huh. Lady tank top. <laughs> lady tank top pink shell basic boxy crop. That was my title. Uh, these sold for $30 each for a dang tank top. Very Love it. Nice. Love nice. that. I think they're light enough that they can go first class together. Together. Twinsies. 6730. I believe I listed these yesterday. Two days ago. Two days. I lost track of the days. That happens. Then we have a mega electronic to box up for those of you that love this kind of thing. <laughs> you're welcome. We're still selling through the electronics. We no longer pick them up. The backlog, yeah. Gosh, if we ever could clear out our garage, we have so many electronics. One day we're gonna just gonna have to go through and we put so much work into it. It's like, I don't wanna just. Yeah, man, eight ounces. Right on eight ounces. Anne Fontaine day. Woo! Maybe I'll make our thumbnail about Anne Fontaine. Maybe. People don't know that. I did that with the Missoni, is it okay? It did, you're right. All right. Well, Dan packs up this. I'll read to you about Anne Fontaine. It'll be like story time. Oh, oh story this is time. what's sold. It's a boombox, boombox, boombox. Wow. <laughs> From Sony. The title is Sony CFD-V25 CD radio cassette recorder, mega bass, mega port, bass. <laughs> port tested and working. Uh, All about that mega bass. It's sold for $35.95. Oh. I'm almost 100% sure this is going to go UPS ground. Yes. It is going to Miami, Florida. Let's see how long that guy's been listed. Goodness. Sony. Yeah, this guy. Since November 29th of 2021. It was relisted two months ago. Dan's grabbing the pool noodles. All right. Oh, I should have got the, the big bub, too. I have some in here. Here we go. Here's some. Thank you. All right. Let's look at, let's learn. Let's learn. Learn time. All right. I'm going to be cutting and wrapping and all sorts of fun stuff here. It's going to be great. Yeah, you can interrupt. It's fine. <laughs> we um, find Anne Fontaine at the thrift sometimes, so that's good. At the same houses, if we go to estate sales, that the women that wear Eileen Fisher tend to wear Anne Fontaine as well. And Eskandar. It's part of the uniform. They sell it at Neiman Marcus. The Anne Fontaine website, the U.S. website, says... Oh, she has a new 2023 cruise collection featuring oh. vibrant windswept silhouettes deftly arranged into flowing shapes with handcrafted details. Maybe you need to get some of that if we are going on a cruise soon. Cruise collection. Sure. <laughs> uh, it's good to know about designers and if you can look up a designer and then figure out their, their collection that's coming out right now, like this was all nautical with blue and white stripes. So that's going to tell you that the 
the more affluent wealthy people are going to have that collection and then everybody else that's not affluent wealthy is going to want it like me and so those kind of things will start selling in your closet or in your store it's a good tip right there it's a hot tip hot tip but you have to keep if you're a clothing reseller i believe you have to keep up with this stuff because trends will change, but if you can be ahead of the trend, so now that we know that Anne Fontaine put out a cruise thing, I'm looking through my thing, and I'm gonna go through all of my listings that are nautical, because I have nautical in there, and I'm gonna add cruise as a keyword. Oh, right? nice idea, I man. mean, it can't hurt. Smart, smart you are. It can't, it just can't hurt. Oh, they have a little video on here. Look at these people, these people are looking nice. It's all nautical. Oh man. Double breasted. Look at this. Okay. The case in point. This is the Lenora jacket that just dropped. The um, Zara jacket I just sold looked just like this, but it was pink. <laughs> it looked exactly like this. Look. Wow. Looked exactly like that. This Lenora jacket, for your reference, is $950. Oh, that all? Okay. Ooh, the Crozet Kimono. Ooh. Yes, ma'am, I want this. So now if I'm selling a bathrobe, maybe I want to call it a kimono. kimono style because Anne Fontaine just dropped one for $2,000. Yikes. I'm not saying. Uh-oh, what happened? Uh-oh. Oh, no, I hope we're still going. Uh, let me see what my, wa my watch says we're going. All right, well, good. this thing just we're going. rebooted. I don't know. I'm not saying you have to find the Anne Fontaine drop because you're not going to find this stuff in the thrift for at least a couple years, right? I'm saying you need to find stuff like it. Because not everybody can afford this kind of thing. Anne Fontaine is a Paris-based fashion designer, I'm reading off Wikipedia, of ready-to-wear for women, business women, and ecologists. What? Fontaine is the creative director. She's an ecologist. Oh. She's the creative director of the Anne Fontaine brand and the president of the Anne Fontaine Foundation. Fontaine has stated that she began drawing and sketching clothes at a young age. The inspiration for the first collection of white shirts came after she discovered a trunk of white shirts in the attic of the family home of her husband, Ari Zlotkin. At that time, he was managing his family business, manufacturing men's white shirts based in Normandy. Fontaine co-founded her brand, Anne Fontaine, with her husband and launched her collection at the age of 22. Wow. She opened her first store in Paris in 1994. She followed with stores in Boston and Tokyo in 1995. Since launching the company, now operates 60 stores worldwide, 28 of which are in the United States. While the brand is still known for its iconic white women's shirts, the fashion line has expanded to include ready-to-wear clothing, accessories, handbags, and shoes. Um, philanthropy. This is where I like to look. In 2011, Fontaine created the New York-based Anne Fontaine Foundation to support the protection of endangered forests and promote reforestation. The foundation's projects are focused on the Brazilian Atlantic forest. To date, the foundation has planted 40,000 trees. Holy moly. Uh, anyway, it says here that our store in Dallas in Highland Village is permanently closed. Oh, man. Yeah, so I'm wondering if these clothes are not going to pop up as much. Is it moving to North Park or something? I don't know. Just that, I heard, I saw something about North Park getting a, a bunch of new stores. Oh, really? Yeah. Should I call? <laughs> it says on Foursquare it's open, but then it said permanently closed on Google. I would trust Google over Foursquare. Yeah. Anyway, they do sell the clothes at places other than the actual store, so you can get them. Well, the real real carries Anne Fontaine, and you can also get them at Neiman's. Estier has Anne Fontaine. Let's see Anne Fontaine. Thread Up has Anne Fontaine. Let's see what kind of deals we can get. Yeah, man. All right, this box needs to get cut down a little bit here. Y'all, there is an extra small Anne Fontaine shirt here for twelve ninety nine. You better buy that. That's kind of paying up, but maybe it'll fit me. That's what I'm saying. There's not a lot. Oh wait, it's oh, y'all. I'm filtering by my sizes. Get out of here. 
What's happening? It was only showing me my sizes. Oh. Yeah, there's some good deals. Yeah, I'm about to buy them right now before you get on here and buy them. <laughs> <laughs> Is anybody source on thread up? Put your emoji of your favorite clothing or hard good item to sell down below nice. for your chance to win a Java sock. I like it. I like it. I think mine would be pants. I love selling pants. What would yours be? Blazer. Blazer, sport coat? Yeah. Sacco? It takes time, but they're fun to do. And there's good returns. So what you want to do if you're shopping on ThreadUp, so like there's a skirt for $8.99. What I do is I screenshot the skirt then I throw it into Google. I'm going to do it with you guys. Okay. I don't know if you can see what I'm doing. I don't know because I don't know. I can't see what we're doing. I screenshot the skirt and then I put it into Google Images because I'm going to comp it. I'm not going to. This skirt is $8.99, by the way. Wow. So I put it into Google Images and of course it's going to give me all of these like other skirts. So when you slide up on Google Images, It'll give you add to your search right here. And so I'm gonna add Anne Fontaine. So Google kind of knows what I'm going for. No results. So then I just change it to Anne and look at the results, the exact skirt on eBay. <laughs> Nice. I would not have thought to, to do that. See, I just put Anne at the top. You know, sometimes people don't know what they're selling or sometimes Google won't pick it up. Anyway, this exact skirt is only listed for $27 on eBay. So I'm not going to pay $8.99 plus shipping to get it to my house. Right. Because I don't blindly buy stuff based on brand. And that's what I'm trying to prove to you right now. I just comped something that I could have bought on ThreadUp and it would have been a bad buy. Even though this brand sells well for us, that skirt... Obviously, I just read to you, she's known for her white basics. This is a black pencil skirt. So those are the kind of things that hopefully you're learning from our channel. Okay, so we're at 18 by 12 and a half by eight. And it weighs nine pounds and two ounces. What? All right, we're in dimensional shipping because of that 12.5 killing us. Uh, you can do 12. What? The box says 12. 18 by 12. Yeah, do 12. It's just fine. Okay, then that's exactly... See, this is what I think. The manufacturers of boxes, they know. Yeah. Okay, so we're just going to do regular. Yeah. Because 1728 Something is... went wrong. Hey, How? Please How? try again. I wasn't talking to you. Hey. Scared the bejeebers out of me. <laughs> so what I'm trying to tell you is the length times width times height of the box needs to be 728. If it's over 728, you have to pay dimensional shipping. 1728. Seven, that's what I meant. Yeah. And it's exactly 1728. Manufacturers, they know. Oh, it's just because I cut it down, though. I magically cut it down to exactly what we needed to make it one cubic Dan foot. Dan magically cut it down. Yes. You look like that baby man. Success kid. Yeah. <laughs> Here's your pen. <laughs> All right. Let's he just these. paid for his dad's like kidney transplant or something. I saw it on the. <laughs> really? Yeah. That's funny. I like. There's that other story about the kid from the meme that's now a football player, a college football player. Which meme? Uh, I forgot, but Popeye put up a billboard. Great, greatness. Great story. <laughs> That's a little thing to that. <laughs> so I think today's sales are definitely going to make up for yesterday. Yeah, yesterday was rough. $37. Woo!
Oh, don't forget the Java sock for Connie. Oh, yeah. Let me grab that. Alrighty. Come on, ladies. Here's Connie. Thank you. Alright, labels, print. Dymo, go. Go. We have another good sale that they haven't paid for yet, and I've seen if they paid. Dan's making Connie a card. So cute. Gotta make the card. Hey, hey, hey. The Why don't you just save it? Uh, oh my, he makes one every time. You get no personalized card, y'all, if you get a job suck. <laughs> personalized. Personalized. That's how we roll. Okay. Yeah, make a note there. This is the five seven two eight. Five. Do that. Seven, that is my rate. Five seven two six. Five seven two six. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> That's what I mean. I'm trying to multitask. I'm sorry. Uh, that is never a good thing with you. <laughs> I know. Okay. Um, seven one six two. Six nine padded flat rate. Oh, fifty four hundred. Seven zero nine seven. Six five two one. Six six eight seven. Six seven three zero six seven two nine. Boom box, boom box, yeah. Okay, get this Java sock ready here. So I put the polish mark orders in a separate bag because. The scan form you print out from eBay doesn't include those, obviously. You all good? Yeah. Do I need to sign it? Are you sure. signing? Sign it. Thank you, Connie. Thank you. It's on its way today. One day we're going to do a YouTube short of us shredding all of these labels. I brought the shredder in here. We're one step closer. Uh, that's what I said. One yeah. step closer. We're going to do it. Come on. Come on. All right. Little. Dan's going to run to the post office and to get my prescription. And then we'll be back to see how much we made today. All right. Lord, here they come. There's one. And there's two. 
a little sneezy. Hey, picnic. Little congesties. <laughs> Look at these cuties in their spot waiting for their treats. Yeah, get it. Oh my God, what a tiny little squeak that was. You guys have been so good all day. First time, first tree, tree time of the day. <laughs> yeah, get it, it's a good one. All right, you guys say bye until next time. Bye. Hello. Okay, so today, February 2nd, Groundhog Day. It does feel like we do the same thing every day. Seriously. Um, 13 items sold, $548 in profit. Hey, that's very excellent. That is very excellent. Yep. So happy about that. Our month to date, we're almost caught up. We're trying to do $300 a day in profit, which would be $600. we are like right there. We're like right there. Come on, February. Come on. Let's do our drawing yeah, giveaway. Yeah, got to give away the Java song. All right, I loaded all of our, what is it, 74 comments. Okay. All right. <gasps> Who's the lucky winner today? Sydney Lou yes. Who Nelson. Yes. 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 I think, Cindy, your comments and your emojis really helped us out. Uh -huh. She got the fortune cookie. Oh, my God. I love it. Yes, <laughs> yes, yes. Okay, Cindy, email us at thathustlecouple at gmail.com, your address, and we will send it on its way tomorrow. Yes, we will. So excited for you. Woo. Thank you for your support. Thank you. Guys, thank you very much for hanging out with us today. And... There's another channel where we do live listing on eBay. Yep. We'll, we'll be there at 7.30 p.m. Central. We'll be there. And there's a link in the description down below. Come and hang out with us. Please. Bye. Bye. Bye.